everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be reacting to Myriad Celestia trailer, a revisiting of past dreams for Honkai Star Rail. Boy oh boy am I excited for Penicone. Really quickly, shout out to my tier 2 Dino Nuggies, Rune, Nico, Ruyi, Moonlight, Christian, Oineza, and Snowball. Thank you all so much for being tier 2 channel members. I really do appreciate it. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the reaction. A dazzling item. Are you looking for its owner? Oh, uh? <laughs> Black Swan? To divine. Oh. Using your memories as a medium. Oh my gosh. Who is that? Oh, is he adventuring in the background? Oh, she is so, oh, she's so beautiful. Oh, Cody is so, oh, I'm so excited. And we have Clocky. Dude, Black Swan is everywhere. Let's go. Was that Sparkle just now too? Yo, this is sick. Put Black Swan, put my girl on every billboard. Yes, sir. Oh, the birds are so cute. And then we have the soul glad. And this must be the banquet. And she is everywhere. She is everywhere, baby. She's literally in your walls. Oh, and we have Robin and Sunday in the background. Okay. Oh. How interesting. Oh! Akron! The truth does not lie. Neither do memories. Oh. Dang. Oh, the Duke! The Duke Inferno! Predestined so paths now. have already converged. She has arrived. Oh. Oh. How? Oh. Is that Sparkle, Aventurine, Firefly, the Duke Inferno? Fire absorbed by the vast, profound sea, and that sea surprisingly dwells on. The planet of festivities. Oh, that was a very ominous ending. Ooh. Okay. All right. We definitely, we most definitely have to rewatch this one because this one was like, was quite fascinating. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Let's give it a rewatch. Okay. So we have the makeup mirror. A dazzling item. A dazzling right. item. And this makeup mirror. Okay. So. This is interesting because this is uh this is Robin's make a mirror and it's being held by that guy. So is is this like is this a uh, past or future? Like do, is does is this like after Robin dropped her mirror? A dazzling item. Yeah, bandaid on his hand. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this must be after Robin dropped her makeup mirror. So are we starting in like the in the future? Like we're starting Okay. Allow me to divine. And that's interesting. I wonder, is that just supposed to be like representative of like Panicone royalty or something? Using your memories as And then it turns into Black Swan. Using your memories as a medium. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. I get it. So she, so she is seeing his memories. Okay. That makes so much more sense now. I didn't understand that when I first medium. started. And we see Aventurine over here. Is there anybody else that we're supposed to recognize? I don't think so. I think it's just Aventurine here. reading a newspaper in the background okay and then we have black swan and then okay i get it so it's like she's going through his memories okay that makes so much more sense now also dude penicone looks oh it looks so good it looks so good oh my gosh i can't wait to explore it's gonna be so much fun and then she becomes clocky oh my gosh and then my girl is in every billboard baby I like this music too. 
this is kind of cool too this little like uh on the door here uh sorry my head's kind of in the way on the door here it's like a uh diamonds clubs spades and hearts like a like a like suits of cards that's kind of cool and that was sparkle right that just yeah that was definitely sparkle hold on go back yeah yeah yeah, yeah that's sparkle okay So it kind of feels like, it kind of feels like this guy, I don't, I don't know if we're going to actually meet him in Penicone, but it feels like he's at least crossing paths with a lot of our prominent characters. Like, is he part of Duke Inferno's plans? Why does he have Robin's makeup mirror? These birds are so freaking cute, oh my gosh. And then we have the Soul Glad, and then we're back to the banquet. And she's, she's sneaking through the lamps. <laughs> Black Swan's so freaking cool. And then, okay, Robin in the spotlight, Sunday off to the side. That's also kind of interesting, and I feel like, um, very reflective of their personalities. Like, Robin seems a lot more reserved, or sorry, I'm, 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 bleh, I'm getting them confused. Uh, Sunday seems a lot more reserved than Robin, rather. <laughs> Bro, she looks so and she's holding a black swan. That's that's a nice little touch there. I didn't I was actually paying attention to that the first time. That's a nice touch. And then there's there it is. Okay, so there's the makeup mirror. And then Sunday has like a bird on his shoulder. Okay. And this is This is really interesting as well. Do you guys know is this like is this where the banquet is being held? Because I feel like we've seen this shape. Maybe it was in like the White Knight music video or maybe it was in Tadalov, but I swear we've seen this like mechanism before. And I'm not sure, is, it, is this like the castle? That's probably what it is, right? It's the castle where the, the banquet's taking place or I don't know if you call it a castle, but okay. And then there's pictures of her on his phone and a Venturine, interestingly enough. And then we have, okay, dang, that's fascinating. And then he picks up the makeup mirror. And then we have Acheron. We, we have, I'm assuming all of this commotion is maybe, um, like, the, maybe the villains have just attacked. Possibly? The truth does not lie. Mm. Neither do memories. Okay. And then, okay, so we have Acheron, Firefly... Aventurine, Sparkle down in the corner, and then Duke Inferno, and then Black Swan, okay. And then we're back to, is this like, present? The present right now? Predestined paths have already converged. Okay, fascinating. That's so interesting. And did the card change? The card changed, right? Wasn't it originally like a card with like a, a princess on it? She has arrived. She has arrived. Is that card supposed to represent Robin? Has anyone found a makeup mirror? Has anyone found a makeup mirror? Thank you. And what do we have? So is this supposed to be... I'm assuming this is supposed to be Robin. We have Duke Inferno. We have Firefly, Aventurine. Is this Acheron and then Sparkle? All of the key players. But she seems surprised by that. She seems, she seems surprised by the Duke Inferno card going up into flames like that. What does that mean? That menacing infernal fire absorbed by the vast, profound sea. Okay. And that sea surprisingly dwells on. How fascinating. Planet, I don't know what to make of that card disappearing. She seems surprised by it. Like, she, she kind of recoiled. She moved her hand when it suddenly burst into flame. That is so fascinating. I really don't know what to make of that. Dang, okay. All right, this just makes me so much more hype for Penicone though. Like again, every single thing they release with Penicone just gets me more and more hyped. I'm so freaking excited to learn more about this storyline. Um, I actually have like a lot of theories and predictions. I'll probably make a video about them before Penicone actually drops because like, oh, I'm just so intrigued. I'm so freaking excited. Okay, um, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please let me know any thoughts that you have down in the comments. Do you guys have any, any thoughts on like the specifics of the cards or like what they all mean or why did the one burn? Like I I don't know what to make of that, but it's really, really interesting. So if you guys have any thoughts or theories on that, let me know down in the comments section. 
please consider subscribing to the channel as well if you do enjoy this type of content. We will most definitely be playing through the Panacone story once once the uh, update drops in Honkai Star Rail, which I'm super, super excited for. Um, and I'd love for you guys to come on the ride with me, so please do subscribe to the channel. Uh, again, don't forget to like the video for the YouTube algorithm, and I will see you guys in the next one. I hope that you enjoyed. Suki, signing off!